Morning. Hopefully you had a good weekend. Our weather actually cooperated for the most part. We had a lot of sunshine on Friday. We had a hot day and a humid day on Saturday, and then it felt much better yesterday. And that was after a couple of thunderstorms uh, that formed on Saturday afternoon. Much of that to the east and south of Topeka and Shawnee County. And there's a look at our clear to partly cloudy sky, but we're going to have quite a bit of cloudiness kind of shooting overhead today. It's currently 60, so it's mild, and the dew points at 55. That's not very high yet. There's the easterly breeze. That's blowing at roughly 5 to 10 miles per hour. And the chance of severe weather today is minimal, but we do have a slight risk as we get into Tuesday and likely Wednesday for almost the exact same area. And we do have some concerns still on the Missouri River, the Neosho River out here toward Tull Creek Lake, and also what's going on up here to the northeast uh, with some aerial flooding. And there's a look at our thunderstorms that are plowing through areas in Nebraska, maybe weakening just a tad in the last hour or two. And what's going on in western parts of Oklahoma also weakening. And we're going to see thunderstorms build with daytime heating and instability. And then we'll have some that go into the overnight that gradually weaken by early morning. And that's what's happening here. It almost looks like we're getting some development, though, right here through the central part of the state that may be trying to connect these two rain areas here. But right now, the only thing going on is in Cloud and Republic County. And that was kind of pulsing up just a little bit and now weakening. Dew points are surging in from the south and southwest. It's 60 in Salina, 57 in Manhattan, Holton at 53. So look for it to be increasingly humid today. And then it's going to stay at that level, it looks like, for a good part of the week. And our air temps are in the upper 50s to low 60s right now. That's not too bad. Much, much warmer south and southeast a little bit cooler out toward the west and northwest. So for today, a lot of cloud cover coming in with the possible thunderstorm. Uh, it's probably about a 30, 40 percent chance, something like that, so not too terribly high. Once we get into this evening, we could have some thunderstorms blow through. Some of those look to be strong. And then once we get into Tuesday morning, that will settle down and then we'll likely have something reform as we get into Tuesday night toward early Wednesday. So it may start to become a bit more nocturnal with a lot of the stuff happening after sunset. But there's your possible storm chance today. The storms this evening and into the overnight. Widely scattered storms as we go through Tuesday. Temperatures warming up into the mid 80s and we're going to stay in the mid 80s for Wednesday. Nothing terribly hot here. In fact, that 89 last Saturday, that might be as warm as we get here for a bit because we look to be in the low to mid 80s and then maybe upper 70s by Friday and Saturday. Widely scattered showers, otherwise variably cloudy this weekend. So I guess for early June, that's not too bad. We just have to hope that some of these scattered storms don't drop very heavy rains. We're just beginning to see some signs of improvement. This is KSNT News. Again, we're live until 7, and we have live updates and network coverage after that.